Hi, my name is Stephen McGee and I'm the author of Toxic Electricity. And I'm here to review a experiment that I'm setting up and it's a stray voltage experiment. So we're going to use the Diefenbachia as our experiment plant. It's also known as the Dumcane. And they're in special pots. I'm going to show you what the pot is like. So this is the pot that they're in. So they have foil in the base and it comes out and is taped to the bottom of the pot. And the purpose of that is so that they get a good connection. And so this aluminum foil that is wrapped right around this base. And you look at this ceramic base, you'll see that there's a lighter foam and it's all foil underneath. So with the weight of the ceramic and the sponge, we get a very good contact to our tiled flooring. And I'm gonna show you what the plan is. So here's one that I set up earlier. So I found out when I was researching toxic electricity that my floor is electrified with stray voltage and stray frequencies. And it's very well known to make people sick. So I've informed my power company and they're refusing to fix the problem, even though it's a known biohazard. So my next step with the power company is to grow these plants in contact with the floor and see what happens with them. And when I get the results, I'm going to send them to the power company with a further request for them to fix the stray voltage that is on my flooring that originates at the grounding system, also known as the neutral system on the utility system. So the experiment's very simple. So one's gonna be in the kitchen. This one is gonna go in my front hallway. And uh, this one is gonna go into my bathroom that has tile floors. And this one is going to sit very close to the ground rods outside the home. And after I do this video, I will put this one into this pot and place it outside by the ground rods. And when I get some results, I will do another video. And if you want to see my latest plant research results regarding electromagnetic radiation, you'll find it in this book. It's called Solar Radiation, Global Warming and Human Disease. Hope you enjoyed the presentation and I wish you the very best of health. Thank you.